with Labour's Glasgow East by-election campaign, a touch of showbiz glamour. But today it emerged John Michie, the star of TV's Taggart series, has spoken in the past about his strong opposition to the union and his support for independence. With the latest from the campaign, here's Tim Reid. <laughs> It might look like a gritty TV drama, it is set in Glasgow's East End, but in reality, just another celebrity helping to win votes. It's great having John, I'm delighted that John is my <laughs> local superstar is here and it's great. Labour's Margaret Curran flanked by a TV detective as she promises to cut crime. Are you a strong supporter of the Labour Party? I am, yes. But Labour certainly doesn't believe in this. It's time to realise that the Union is the last vestige of an empire on which the sun has well and truly set. An independent Scotland would find a new confidence. So Margaret Curran is out on the campaign trail again today. She has been all the way through the campaign, but there's no sign today of the man she calls her superstar, nor is there any idea whether he will return to the campaign trail to be next to Margaret Curran. Well, what John did tell me in a, a conversation was to say his views have been misrepresented in the past. Comments that he has made, some people assumed, meant that he was supporting the SNP. He's supporting Labour. He's supporting me in this election. And that's what's important. It's rather overshadowed Labour's campaign today. <laughs> there was this, was this stuff you got lined up for us It's on your list. Speaking of grafting. Whilst what? rivals, out with some what? actors what? of their own, what? claim it's another gaffe. I think the Labour campaign here is well, accident prone, let's put it that way. But, uh, well, I, I welcome all support for, for, for independence. Well, I mean, I think Labour's campaign has been incoherent and it's got very curious bedfellows and I have to say, I think its campaign is just descending into complete disarray. This actor's obviously not committed to the Labour Party cause and is just doing them a favour. It shows that they're in disarray in Scotland. So, has the actor's script changed? He's been unavailable today, but Labour are certain he's supporting them. Tim Reid reporting Scotland, Glasgow East. And for a full list of candidates in the Glasgow East by-election, go to bbc.co.uk forward slash Scotland News. And later, Newsnight Scotland will be hosting a by-election hustings. Here's Glenn Campbell to tell us some more. It's the by-election battle for Glasgow East. Tonight, the questions will come from an audience of EastEnders. They'll be putting on the spot our panel, including candidates from the four largest parties in this by-election. That's Newsnight Scotland, a Glasgow East by-election special, tonight over on BBC Two from 10.30.